Hey guys, how's it going with Legend of Fuzzy? And I've got a Crisis 3 done big commentary for you guys today. And I am using the Scarab with, um, I believe I'm using the Silencer with the Reflex Sight. And maybe, no, no, I don't have Extended Max. So <laughs> I have full grip actually, yeah. Um, this is quite an old gameplay, guys. I probably don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> um, I may break out into commentary mode uh, for the for the gameplay, and then I'll go, probably go back to my topic, which I'll get to in a second. Um, yeah, I just, just it's just a random gameplay. I go twenty five to four, um, just some lone wolf gameplay. Um, and also, if you guys haven't realized, I'm trying to like just get around these um, render settings and like just video settings in general, just so I can find cool ways of enhancing my video quality. Because um, from what I can see, it's not very good quality, as in like the video quality. Um, I think, I reckon the audio quality is alright, if you guys, um, have any suggestions or anything, or maybe even what you think about my videos, let me know, and I'll find ways of improving my videos, uh, just for better, like, quality. Um, yeah, so, today guys, I wanted to talk about a topic which is pretty close, um, to me, um, and that is, mo uh, well, not movies, <laughs> um, TV series. Um, so, television series are a pretty big part of, um, society, I guess, because t the TV is a big, big source for, ent for entertainment, and people need entertainment, because if you're not entertained, then you're gonna probably be a, a nasty old git. Um, TV keeps us entertained, keeps us tuned in, um, it can reflect on, like, social and cultural values that we, that we probably, um, have. That kind of stuff that, like, relates to us, we can relate to something, uh, whether, or whether it be fiction or non-fiction, who knows. But, I'm just going to talk to you guys about TV shows that I watch and I think are really, really good. And maybe you guys uh, might even watch them as well. I mean, um, some of my subscribers may even watch it and some may not. And I'm just going to let you know, like, I can't talk. <laughs> I'm just going to let you guys know about, um, about TV shows that, you know, are pretty, pretty good in general. Um, as well as, I'm going to back it up with my, um, personal opinion. Although, probably me saying that it's pretty good is a personal opinion, but whatever. <laughs> so, let's get into it. So, my first one I wanted to talk about was Breaking Bad. Now, Breaking Bad is a very, very popular, um, TV series. It's probably, it's one of the most top, uh, well, it's one of the most, uh, popular TV shows in the world, um, well, at least according to IMDb, <laughs> um, IMDb says that, uh, I think Breaking Bad's like the fourth, fourth most popular, or fourth best, uh, TV show, um, that being, that the other, the other three are gonna be, I think it's some David Attenborough documentary, um, and I think it's, it's The Sopranos, I'm not sure, um, uh, but yeah, Game of Thrones is up there, definitely. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, Breaking Bad, the uh, ninth episode of the fifth season, just came out yesterday. And guys, it was really, really awesome. I really did enjoy that episode. I cannot wait for the next one. Because with Breaking Bad, every episode, I'm looking forward to the next episode instantly. At the end of the, at the, at the, end of the episode, I'm really looking forward to the next one. And and that that's really that that's the thing I like about Breaking Bad. Um and just just the style. I mean, Breaking Bad. Do you reckon the narrative, or maybe not the narrative, but like the the style, um and well yeah, ba basically the story in general. Do you reckon it's ever really been used before? I mean, like, do you ever see much TV shows about um making meth, a chemistry teacher, um getting cancer and yeah, making meth and shit? It's it's not something you uh you would see prior to um Breaking Bad's um introduction onto, onto uh, I think it's AMC, um, but yeah, I mean, it's, Breaking Bad is just a really, really great show, it's, um, pretty individual, I mean, um, it wasn't obviously a concept that was used a while ago, I believe Breaking Bad came out in 2008, um, and then this is, this is the last season, so it's been five seasons, and, um, yeah, I mean, I, I just cannot wait for the next, uh, episodes, I think there's eight more episodes, maybe, um, I'm uh, not quite, not, not, I'm not too sure, but I have to look on Wikipedia, <laughs> Um, but yeah, I mean, I love Breaking Bad, Breaking Bad is awesome, and let's go into the next one. Now, The Walking Dead. The Walking Dead, by far, is probably my favourite TV show, um, on TV. It, it, it's just awesome, I mean, zombies, zombies are the best, and zombies are awesome. Um, and including, like, a uh, awesome redneck, um, a f quite flawed, um, well, morally flawed cop, 
with his bitch son and his, um, I'm not gonna spoil anything, <laughs> um, but I mean, yeah, Walking Dead is so, so cool, and I don't, I don't know why, um, it's not really that highly rated, um, it's gone about, like, 8.9, I think, on IMDb, um, but still, I mean, loads of people watch Walking Dead, but it's not as popular as the other shows like Game of Thrones and Breaking Bad, and I, I understand the reasons for it, um, it's just that I, I think Breaking Bad, I mean, Walking Dead is just a lot better than shows like Breaking Bad and Game of Thrones, that's my opinion, I know people are going to get, probably get angry about me saying that Walking Dead is better than Game of Thrones, but that's, that's my opinion, I just really, <laughs> I really like, um, Walking Dead, I just love the, um, the idea, and also that it's based off a comic book, um, series that that that's pretty cool as well i mean i i, know, I never read the or i've never read the um comics or whatever but i don't know i mean i love i just love the i love zombies and i love the characters and the the fact that unexpected deaths can occur unexpe <laughs> unexpectedly uh what did i say Un unexpectedly yeah yeah <laughs> um yeah like it's that that's one of the things about um, Walking Dead, how char char like characters can just die without um well, well I mean like, just very un unexpectedly. I mean like you'll go find a main character who's been in like the three seasons and then he just dies in the first the, the first episode of the next season. I mean it's very very um strange, um and and it, and it really keeps you watching. Um even though your favorite character may be dead and hopefully Daryl Dixon doesn't die. I mean no one wants him to die because he's an epic character. But if your favorite character does die, I mean. My opinion, or like, well, for me, I'll I'll keep on watching the show because it's still freaking awesome. All the characters are pretty much awesome, um, maybe apart from Rick's son, uh, <laughs> but uh, still, it's it's just an amazing show. And let's go on to the next one, Game of Thrones. Uh, yes, I do watch Game of Thrones. Every much everyone watches, everyone watches Game of Thrones. Um, Game of Thrones is a very very awesome show, but the problem is for me, I cannot remember any of the names of the characters. I can't remember what happened in the previous season. It's just, really, <laughs> there's so many characters, there's so many episodes and like so many stuff in the, in the narrative I cannot remember. So I have to go back and watch the other seasons, or the, yeah, the other seasons and the other episodes. Um, <laughs> I, st I, I just don't get around to doing it and I don't know what I'm looking, I, 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 don't, I don't know what I'm looking at. But um, I don't know, it's, it's still very entertaining to watch. It's a very entertaining um, TV show um, and... I can't remember that Martin something invented it and he did the books and that. Um, <laughs> he seems like a pretty chill dude. I mean, like, Game of Thrones was the most pirated um, TV series. Um, I, actually, no, I think it was the most, the most pirated thing. Um, actually, no, I think he said the most pirated media saw, uh, thing of 2012. And he took it as a, as a compliment, which is, which is quite incredible. I mean, most people would start bitching and stuff. Uh, I mean, I I'm, I'm, I don't know what I'll do, but I mean, still, he was, he's just a pretty chill dude. And then, next show, The Vikings. Vikings, I've just started watching that show. Uh, I'm into the third episode, and that show is actually really, really good, considering um, that uh, my childhood consisted of, like, mythology, and that includes, like, the Norse, Greeks, and uh, Romans, and Egyptians. Um, but the Norse, who are the Vikings, they, uh, they really did... Um, get me into like just um playing games like uh well rts games like age of empires age of mythology that kind of stuff and vikings is just a really really cool show um it's quite like game of thrones if you guys haven't um seen it before um uh, it has it has similar ideas and themes and concepts that game of thrones has but i really do recommend you guys watch that show and i'm out of time which really sucks um anyway yeah so i hope you guys did enjoy the video with the commentary let me know what your favorite TV show down in the description is, <laughs> or comments, whatever. I'll see you guys later. Bye.